welcome back this one is another one uh smening that uh, has been so kind and supportive our prayer has been that the good lord continue to support you even as you have been so supportive to our channel and we say a very big amen to that all right my good people this one is another one you know the incident that took place uh, in lagos state as a uh, a young lady who was adopted right at the government uh, owned control bus known as the BRT she was adopted and uh, killed and now we are talking about uh, 10 things to do to be safe on the BRT vehicles and uh, that has been on today's as since the death of one of the passengers in the person of uh, Oluwa Bespsemi Ayowole Many citizens of Lagos State have been worried about how safe it is to travel on the bus raped uh, transit vehicle in the state of Lagos. Based on what we have gathered and information got into us right on our desk, we had reported that uh, Oluwa Bamese, who was or uh, who closed from work around 7 p.m. on Friday, being February 26, was. Uh, on her way to visit her brother below me when she boarded the BRT vehicle around the Chevron bus stop in Lakey area of the state. Meanwhile, her corpse was later found dumped by the roadside, according to the police, which or who revealed that the driver of the vehicle, Omimi Mokron Nice had been arrested my good people on today's this led to an astrogious and protest on the social media and in the stress of uh, lagos in the street of lagos so many things has happened and people are really saying their mind because it's a very striking and very shocking news that uh, here in the country no one is safe even right in the government owned vehicle we are things uh, are running and government is a uh, is a place where we're supposed to be safe brt i beg your pardon is where we're supposed to be safe not even elsewhere to avoid finding yourself uh, in a similar situation as uh, oluwa bami say here are some tips to keep you safe while traveling on brt vehicles and one of it is that ask if the vehicle has a CCTV camera, as most of them don't have, especially the locally built ones. If the vehicle doesn't have one, it is uh, advisable to wait for the one that uh, has. And that has been on today's. And the second thing that I uh, need to know, if uh, the vehicle doesn't have a CCTV camera, try as much as you can to know the vehicle's license number. If possible, take a picture of it and uh, send it to a relative or friend, alerting them of your journey. The most important thing is to create awareness or to tell someone who is relatively known to you or who is your friend, your journey or your whereabouts for security purposes. And another thing is to ensure that if you are not uh, the only passenger in the vehicle, make sure that the passenger are about five at least and don't uh, or don't uh, they look suspicious you should be courteous and you should be careful enough to see and to observe things you know you, ha you got to ensure that you are not the only passenger in the vehicle make sure that the passenger are about uh, five at least and if they don't, you need to be careful. And if they are not looking so suspicious, your instincts will tell you. In a situation where the passenger in the vehicle are not much, ensure you sit close to the exit or by the window to make yourself visible to other road users. In a situation where the passengers in the vehicle are not much, ensure that you sit close to the exit or by the window to make yourself visible to other road users. Yes, it is a very important one. And that's my good people. The one is another one is that uh, if ever you feel unsafe, make sure or make use of the 
emergency button in the vehicle which connects to it the control room this allows the officials in the control room to monitor the vehicle's activities remember that brt bus brt vehicles do have emergency numbers put a call through to one of the, them and uh, if you ever feel unsafe put a call across emergency number is written boldly in the brt but a call through put a call through to one of them if you ever feel unsafe if traveling at night very importantly ensure that the brt vehicle has inner light yes this allows other road users to see what is going on inside the bus but it's the responsibility of the driver to make this uh, done but if certainly there is darkness in the in the brt bus i think the passengers equally notify the driver by telling him to put it on ensure you ensure you you alert at your bus stop yes ensure that you are allowed in your bus stop and not along the road stop at your bus stop and not along the road object if the driver suggests dropping you by the roadside as this may be a a, a blow to the explosion you do not ritually so armed robbers looking around the corner yes you should stop in a place where you know very well as questions arise the alarm if the driver decides to play a different route other than his uh, designated route yes very important my good people as questions are raised the alarm if the driver decides to play or apply a different route other than his uh, designated route if you had information your relative of your journey ensure you let them know when you alerted safely this will not only put the mind at rest but we also prevent a situation where the driver of the brt bus vehicle will be wrongly accused what this is trying to say is that uh, if you had information or if you have informed your relatives of your journey ensure you let them know when you are letters safely this will definitely make or put their mind at rest and then not uh, also prevent a situation where the driver of the brt vehicle will be wrongly accused my good people that has been on this as uh, we have really much allowed uh, things to do to be safe on any government owned official buses using brt as a point and because of the incident that took place in lagos state where a lady was adopted right from the government owned uh, vehicle brt in lagos state and since his, and since her death and uh, a lot of people many citizens of lagos state have been worried about how safe it is now to travel on the B on the bus uh, rapid transit vehicle in the state of Lagos. And that has been onto this one, my good people. Not not much to say on this. Well, let me have your take and then remember to tap on the subscription button for more update. Thank you and God bless you.